Wheat corn is grown in all 50 states of US. In 2022, the US harvested an estimated 340,000 acres of sweet corn and it worth around 91.73 billion US dollars. So let's explore how it is done. Sweet corn, also called the sugar corn and the pole corn, is a variety of corn growth for human consumption with a high sugar content. Sweet corn is the result of a naturally occurring recessive mutation in the genes which control conversion of sugar to starch inside the endosperm of the corn kernel. Sweet corn is picked when still immature and prepared and eaten as a vegetable rather than field corn, which is harvested when the kernels are dry and mature. Since the process of maturation involves converting sugar into starch, sweet corn stores poorly and must be eaten fresh, canned or frozen before the kernels became tough and starchy. It is one of the six major types of corn, the others being dent corn, flint corn, pot corn, popcorn and floor corn. According to USDA, 100 grams of raw yellow sweet corn contains 3.43 gram glucose, 1.94 gram fructose and 0.89 gram sucrose. First of all, the planting of corn seeds take place. Now it's time to harvest sweet corn for nest process. The harvest is done by different machines, sometimes the corn falls so the corn picker is used instead of harvester.
Now the main process begins which is called the shelling. In this process, the cover is removed from the shell. Sometimes the beans are also removed from the shell. Now the shelled corn is transferred to the next process that occurs in factories. If we talk about can and corn, it is made like this. It's all our favorite popcorns that are passes through these steps before reaching us. <laughs> 